Good morning, everybody. It's Monday, the 27th. It's 7 a.m. I woke up about half an hour ago, bright and early. I am still croaky. I still look like a mess. I've got a bit of makeup left, so I look crazy right now. Not my greatest morning look, I gotta say. <laughs> I had a bit of a early night last night. Um, I went to sleep at 10.30 p.m., which is unlike me. I usually go to sleep very, very, very late because of insomnia, but yesterday didn't catch up with me, so I'm very happy about that. Um, I managed to sleep early to get the day started, which makes me really happy. It just makes me, it sets the mood right for the week, and I've already made myself a hot chocolate here, and I've got a croissant with some watermelon on there, um, so I'm going to have that for breakfast watch a little bit of something while I eat breakfast and then get on started with the day I guess I mean I'm gonna hop into the shower real quick to actually wake up because I'm getting a bit sleepy again which I am actually able to like fall asleep for like another two hours not gonna lie although I did sleep like seven but like nine's my peak like nine if I get nine then I was asleep but, oh. <laughs> anyway I'm not gonna bore you with much but welcome to quarantine vlog week I'm not well I mean we've been quarantined for like over a month now but I'm just showing you what is this week three that I've shown you I'm bored in the house and I'm in the house bored so we're trying we're trying okay have a look at how delicious my hot chocolate looks like it looks bomb First time in years Got my feet across the border From a land of I've showered, I've gotten ready, um, or well, half ready, I still haven't put makeup on, <laughs> but i washed my hair, done my skincare, moisturised, feel all nice and, you know, ready. I also whitened my teeth today, it was not as white as my t-shirt, but it's getting there. I don't want them to be this white either, though I think it's like a bit creepy. <laughs> don't know, I think that's just me. Um, but yeah, the thing that I use to whiten my teeth is always has always been like High Smile. I've been using it for two years, and I love it. It works so well. A lot of people ask me questions about it, like, does it really work? Like, is it expensive? How easy it is to use? And blah blah. But it's really really nice. I'll get into it a little bit later. And um, I'm gonna start editing, so I'm gonna be gone for a while. There's no point me recording this because I need to do this very quickly because I need to get this video up as fast as I can. <laughs> Look at this. I made breakfast. Yum. 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 <laughs> Yum. Hi guys. Good afternoon. It's Tuesday today. Um, you just finished watching the Monday clips. Um, and after that delicious breakfast, let me fill you in on what happened. I basically locked myself in my cave for basically eight hours editing non-stop trying to fight the computer and doing this like I, I was doing a bunch of stuff um for the vlog that i wanted to get out um and it kind of like you know had a little bit of a technical faulty there don't, don't you know but it's fine it's fine <laughs> it really stressed me out yesterday so that's why i didn't want to vlog because i was really stressed out and i was in a bad mood because i wasn't getting the stuff i wanted to do done like it just i was fighting with my computer um it got slow at some point and it just didn't want to run final cut pro crashed twice i lost like a bit of footage and i can't get it back there's a bunch of stuff that happened but i managed to upload that and by the time i finished doing all of that i was actually having dinner like at 10 p.m and just watched like what two episodes of el dragon which i am obsessed with sadly i finished it today um but it's really good i highly recommend um if you like queen of the south and you haven't watched that before or you haven't watched any of that then like it's basically about like drug cartels 
here in Mexico, but like that's that's like Queen of the South and like how it kind of moves into the low like Texas. Um, this on the other hand is same thing ish, um, but with an Asian twist. Uh, um, Japan's involved, and that's all I'm gonna really gonna say. Um, but if you really enjoyed Queen of the South, you're gonna enjoy this one because oh honey, there are 44 episodes in the second season, which is the newest one, and each one's like at least 36, 40 minutes long. So I'm very pleased with that. Sadly, I finished it today, but I highly recommend. Um, I watched it from the second season. I didn't watch the first season because it wasn't available in the UK on Netflix. But if you can find it, you can. Hi. If you can find it, I highly recommend it. Hi, come here. Come say hi. Come say hi. Say hi to the vlog. Hello. <laughs> But yeah, um, I just locked myself in the cave, watched those videos, and that's it. And now today is another day. Um, and I got up early, had some cereal, and edited a way to upload today's video because I couldn't manage. I, I didn't manage to edit it. Come here, come here, my yeah. I couldn't manage to edit it um, yesterday because of the same technical faulties that I had. So, I did that today, and I just binge watched some episodes from another one. I finished it today. Um, and that's it. Yeah. Oh, he's purring so much. I want to color and do something. Like, I'm trying to keep myself sane. I'm not going to lie because I'm kind of tired of doing the same things over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. <laughs> but it's okay. We're going to get it. It'll be okay. goes up and I haven't uploaded a vlog in a really long time and it's kind of like nice especially for my family members and people like you know that like to keep me close they like watching that and they see what I'm up to and well hi to all of you watching <laughs> um but yeah I don't know I just really like I feel like vlogs are kind of special to me because they're always memories I can look back upon and it's just nice I guess I always rewatch my vlogs I woken up about an hour ago, but I've just been in bed replying to everyone. Anyway, I'm gonna have some breakfast. I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea, so I wanna read a little bit in the morning, I'm not gonna lie. showered and now I'm gonna just do my hair really quickly I have a lot of things to do when I'm starting to panic because I'm like it's the afternoon and I don't want it to be late and like does there anyone else ever get like this like I generally have done stuff but once it gets to the afternoon and you haven't done like quite a chunk of the things that you wanted to do throughout the day you start panicking you're like I'm not gonna get it done by the end of the day so 
that's gonna be my situation. I just gotta do my hair because it's looking like this. I can't wait to go back to UK and be able to do my hair or even like I just don't want someone to fuck my hair up here in Mexico and then my hairstylist kill me because I just do you see this <laughs> so whatever that's not important people are dying out there Nicole people are dying out there <laughs> and I'm not like I'm not laughing about it. I'm just laughing at how I'm complaining about that people are dying out there and you're complaining about your fucking hair Nicole like get it, get, get it together get it straight what the fuck <laughs> But yeah, I'm just gonna go do my hair and I'll be back. there I had a video call with one of my friends and I'm so happy that I got to video call with him banner if you're watching this by any like you know chance <laughs> it was really nice talking to you and yeah I just I had I had a lot of fun I talked to him for like what an hour probably maybe longer um I hadn't video called him in a while and it's been a while since I've seen him obviously he's the um, to all of you watching, I don't know who Banner is, when I say Banner, obviously, I mean, <laughs> then again, if you watch my vlogs, then you, well, no, I'm not gonna generalize, but he, um, he's a DJ in the e-group bit, at Shush, and that's how I know him, <laughs> but I love him to bits, and I had a lot of fun talking to him, so really happy about that. Look at what my aunts are making! <laughs> It tastes amazing. They made me try it. Mm, okay. <laughs> they made me try it for like just the taste because they, they're vegetarian so they don't eat meat but this has meat and they're making it for my cousin. And it tastes amazing and I got so hungry after that so I'm just here in the kitchen like <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> can I have more? So I just asked her if we can make some and we're gonna make lasagna right now. I haven't made lasagna in years I think. Years. It's been a really really long time since the last time I vlogged but Basically, what's happened is that <laughs> um, we were cooking, well they were cooking, my aunts were cooking, and shit, I was just trying the food, <laughs> um, and it was bomb, it was amazing, but we were cooking for like hours, and we were just chatting in the kitchen, and just talking about like life and stuff, after like that um, video call that I had, so we were just over there, finishing cooking and everything, we finished quite late, we finished until like what 10 p.m we finally sat down to like have some food i didn't eat anything all day so it was glorious um had some dessert that they made like um it's like this milk sweet milk rice dessert that we make here i don't know what's called in english um arroz con leche and it's really good it's bomb um so i had a ton of that they made me some lasagna so i was really happy about that too and well we just um watched a friends episode literally they watched the news for like half an hour and then we watched like two friends episodes and that's it like that's how late it was anyway so i just come to my room and i started watching some youtube videos but i got woken up because i was already falling asleep i got woken up by mosquito and i've tried to put repellent on but it kind of flourished right now so I'm very paranoid because if a mosquito bites me, it like feasts on me. So there's that. And I mean, good thing that it woke me up because it reminded me that I need to say goodnight to you. 
I didn't vlog a lot today, but got quite a few things done, quite happy. Um, but it's nearly three, and I have to try and sleep at some point. I mean, yesterday slept at three, but you know, I edited a whole video, so probably done that today too. <laughs> anyway, good night for me. I hope the mosquito doesn't kill me, but we'll see tomorrow. Bye. Hi guys, good morning. Um, it's Friday today. Um, it's nearly midday. Um, I didn't film yesterday because I had a severe, severe migraine. I still, it still lingered on till today. I still kind of have a headache. It still hasn't gone away. So obviously I didn't feel like filming anything. I felt really miserable. <laughs> um, yeah, there's not much to say about yesterday. I didn't do anything. <laughs> So there was no way I was filming me getting a migraine and just being grumpy and no thank you. Right now, I'm removing my nails. Because <laughs> I've had them on for a long time and um, I, my nails need a break and I want to make pizza and I don't want to get my nails all like icky and stuff. And they're already like falling down and I need to a fill anyway so it's just about time. Um, obviously I feel really weird without nails. But you know, we need a break and then I can do them again. <laughs> but as for now... I look like a complete alien. <laughs> so I'm just waiting for this to soak and I can remove. I'm very backlit, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, you can't see me, never mind. Um, I'm just gonna, you know, you see a bit there. <laughs> this looks really funny. <laughs> the tea, I'm having tea, mango, and I'm trying to work on my iPad, do a meal plan, and um, what else was I doing? Not a bunch of other stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to be doing this for a little bit and hopefully this comes off soon. <laughs> Hi guys, it's been a minute. I think I'm zooming. Yes, I am. Very much so. Um, as you can see, I've got makeup on. I, it's been many, many hours later and I took all my nails off. I have baby fingers now. Um, I just put a clear top coat on and like, you know, filed my nails and made them pretty, buffed them, polished them, everything. I did that. I showered, I did some skincare because my skin's not feeling too great. I don't know if you can see, but I've got like a bump here, a bump here, here, and here. I don't know um, what's going on, so I'm on like this rampage of cleaning everything. And like I cleaned my face, I did some products. It feels kind of smooth now, much smoother than it was before I did any of that. Um, I used the, I'll go into the bathroom and show you, but I used the Glam Glow um, 60 second, in is it Instamod? I don't know, it's the yellow tube with the purple mask that foams up. And ju you just use that mask six 60 seconds and it just like magically fixes your pores. So I used that, I also exfoliated and I used the um, Le Crème Concentré by Ambrelis. And I just did my makeup, um, I tidied like I did my laundry, I ironed it, I folded it, I've done, I've washed my bedding, I just have like this cover, the grey cover on right now, because I filmed the video in Spanish, um, I just filmed like this entire look in Spanish, it's my first video in Spanish, I'm a little bit nervous, um, but yeah, that's gonna be up, I think by the time you see this it's already gonna be up anyway, might be the day, like literally the video before this, I'm not sure, but um, I'm sure if it's up, you won't miss it. It'll probably be at the end of the screen anyway. Um, but yeah, that's basically what I've done. Um, I was watching a bit of series with my aunts. And yeah, I've been just doing all of that really tidying. And I poured myself a glass of like wine-ish. It's not really wine, is it? I mean, it's like 3% alcohol wine. So I don't really count it as wine. It's kind of like a beer. Like kind of like cider for me. So, I like this. It's the peach one. It's amazing. I, my, my fingers feel like sausages without nails and I hate it. But it's delicious. Delicious. <laughs> it's delicious. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to update you on what I've been doing. I really didn't want to film it because I've already filmed it in another one of my vlogs. So I don't want you to get bored and have the same content. So, I've done that. Um, I've got to wash my brushes, so I think I'm going to show you that bit because I don't think I've shown you how I actually wash my brushes. Anyways, um, it's it feels like Saturday today. I don't know why. It just feels very Saturday, -y, like weekendy. So I haven't eaten anything aside from breakfast and some a snack and this wine. 
So I'm going to make myself a bagel because I'm really craving a bagel. Um, I have a Sonia leftover that my aunt made for me, but I just, I mean, I'll show you. But I don't feel like having it right now. I feel like having a bagel. It's a very bad angle. <laughs> but I'm actually knackered. I'm so tired. And I've still got to edit the video for tomorrow. Um, i still got hours left. But it's 9 p.m. So I want to have some food. <sighs> It's really dark in this room, as you can tell. I'm gonna... I hope that helps. I have my pillows up there, because like I said, I'm doing the washing. So I'm gonna remove my makeup up here. And do the next wash, which is this cover. Because I want my bed to be ready for when I go to sleep. Okay, I'm very backlit. And I'm balancing you on a scrub and a moisturizer. But I think we're okay. Now, um, I would probably be a little bit higher and this is very uncomfortable for me, so you're not even going to see my face. But I just wanted to show you the products that I use, and then I'll get into the time lapse. Okay, so I've tied my hair back. Um, the products that I use to clean my brushes are um, some oil for like any creamy products, so anything like this or like a foundation brush that are dirty with, you know, creamy products are very hard to just get like clean with the um, soap. I use an oil. You could use a balm too, but um, this is the oil that I have right now. So, yeah, you can get this in Mexico basically anywhere. And I think you can now get this at Boots. Don't quote me. I'm not entirely sure. I know you can get the oil, the face oil that I always use, but I'm not sure about this. Um, you can get plenty of like balms, like oily products to break down um, the cream. Because essentially, if you think about it logically, this is what I use to remove my makeup, like the first cleanse. So, naturally, it's going to get rid of the other um, product from my brushes. And then after I go in with that clean, I use just like regular dish soap. I like to use like, you know, the one with like creaminess or like extra added cream or like, you know, softer ones. So it's like gentler on the brushes as well. But there are some really good brush uh, cleaners out there in the market. I just generally like to use this or bar soap. So anything really, um, I just don't really use the actual like brush cleaners because I just find that they don't get all the gunk out. But so far the best one I've liked are the, is, like, is the Real Technique ones, I haven't tried any other ones really. Um, yeah, that's how I wash my brushes, so now you're just going to see me wash the first like big chunky creamy brushes. Like I go by sizes, this is how I like to do mine, I'm just going to go here. I go by sizes, I go by like the big ones, but I do the creamy ones first where I grab the oil and then the soap and go from large to small because this is like the no contour one. And then once I'm done with all the cream ones, then I go into like just the soap one and I stop using the oil and I just use the ones that are just like, like with powders, eyeshadows and stuff like that. I just use the soap. So essentially that's what I like to do. Um, but yeah, let me just get started. I finished washing my brushes and um, now I've just put them here for now. Um, I'm going to let them dry a little bit because usually I just go ahead and dry them with a the little machine that I have and I'll show you how I do that but um, I really, really, really am starving. So I'm going to just leave them there for a little bit. It's fine. I mean, that's why you usually leave them to dry like overnight and wait an entire day for them to dry but I'm going to show you a little like hack. Of how to clean them really really quickly and you can get this tool on Amazon. Let me just try to find it It's this tool right here now. It looks really weird and just you know Not for what it's meant to do, but basically you turn a button on from here and it spins And you can get battery-powered ones or you can get the one that I have 
that um, comes with a USB, a micro USB right here. So you can just charge it and you don't need to use batteries, for, you, don't, you don't need to like, you know, think of any of those things. And use this with one of the heads here. You can use it with these heads. It has four, mine has four different ones and I got mine on Amazon for like 18 pounds. I got it, um, I think 2018, maybe 19, no, I think it was 19, yeah. Um, last last year, last summer, and it's changed the game. I used to get so lazy washing my brushes, but now, like, you know, the only part that I get lazy with is actually just standing and doing it, but I, I could just get a seat and do it. Um, but it's good for your skin. You don't, like, gather bacteria because you don't wash your brushes, like, every week or two and wait a really long time like I used to, then you can start breaking out because it gathers a lot of bacteria. Those brushes gather a lot of bacteria. So, um, I like to use that, but I'll show you in a little bit. I just got to have some food because I'm starving. It's like 9.50, so I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go have some food. I don't know what's going on. Mama? Hi, love. Hello. He's so cute. Okay, I want a bagel and a tea, I think. So, ooh, there's a croissant. My croissants are here, so I think I might make a croissant then. In your usual space where you're, I'm very backlit, but, but yeah, I'm gonna make myself, I think a hot chocolate. I was having wine, I know, but I need a mug. I have a Winnie, a Winnie the Pooh mug, and some Swiss Miss marshmallow hot cup, hot, 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 hot cocoa mix. So I'm just gonna do that. All right, I made myself a croissant. I'm just gonna pop in the microwave to just heat the cheese up because I want it to get melted and I'm too lazy to wait for anything. And I'm gonna make the hot chocolate. So my croissant's here and I'm eating these chips. They're literally called chips. <laughs> there you go, fuego. And, and my three drinks. Ice, icy water, my wine, and hot chocolate. <laughs> I am so hungry. I'm so hungry and so tired, so I'm gonna start eating. We're gonna probably watch something. Uh, I'll see you in a bit, I'm so tired. <laughs> okay, um, I obviously, as you saw, I just had my dinner and I'm just gonna dry my brushes now because I am so tired and I just can't wait to get my makeup off. Um, but basically, what I use is this machine, I don't even know what it's called, it just spins your brushes and essentially what you do is you just put the head on this and then press this button that's at the bottom and it spins it and it has two speed settings it has one hold on and then two and then it comes off and always oh, my head's being cut off right now but I don't really need any any I don't have any brushes this size this flat size it says even the Diameter of this in millimeters. This is 24 to 31 millimeters, but I don't have any brush that are this, brushes that are this thick. So I grab this head, which is the second biggest one. They go by sizes. This is the, from biggest to smallest. I'm gonna grab this bigger one. And I'm gonna grab all the brushes. Try not to spill all of them in here. And what you just do is you stick it in there. Make sure it's secure and straight. Otherwise, it goes wonky. And then I just put it down. And all the water is coming off right now is just spinning it round, and the brush will literally be like just completely dry. I don't even know how to explain it. Because usually with brushes you have to wait for like an entire day, and this is why I love this. So yeah, I just wait for about 10 seconds more or less. Feel it, and it's still a bit damp, so I'm gonna give it another go. And there, it's completely dry. Like, I just, I love this. I love this. So it's ready to just be put back into its space. And it's amazing. I love it. Let me just show you with like a more, oops, now I got it wet again. But whatever. Let me just show you with like a more dense brush, like this one. It's just, you know, dense, it looks wet. This is too big. I feel like I have another brush that's just as big as that. Which one? Is it this one? No, I think that's it. That's the biggest one I have. Yeah. There we go. The next size. And I'm literally like, 
I don't know how it explains but I'm getting like all wet. <laughs> One more go. And there. It's so dry. Like, you know, you can see it's all fluffy and it's not damp or anything. I love this. So I'm just going to continue doing this for all my brushes, except for the smaller ones for my eye brushes. I literally leave it for three seconds and prefer to leave those to dry because then um, it does spin it really quickly and I prefer to use it on my bigger brushes that take ages to dry. Um, for my eye brushes, such as like these brushes that are a bit more delicate, the blending brushes, I leave it for like three seconds. See, this is like almost dry anyway. So I'll leave it for like three seconds, otherwise it gets a bit frayed and damaged. So that's what I like to do. I'm just gonna finish doing this and then I'll remove my makeup and go to bed. Maybe I'll start editing a little bit, but I just I need to sleep early, otherwise I'm just I'm just not gonna make it. <laughs> I'm done. I'm gonna put this in my room and rub my makeup because I'm so tired. But they're done. It's all done. They're all clean. They're all dry, ready for use tomorrow morning, <laughs> which makes me really, really happy. I've gotten ready for bed. Um, took my makeup off, as you can see, obviously. Um, but I piled on the vitamin C eye cream. I piled on the vitamin E moisturizer and. I am good to go for bed. Uh, <laughs> I'm really liking how my skin feels like texture wise. Um, not exactly how it looks because I got a few like bumps. Um, but these bumps like don't feel like, you know, sometimes you got texture. And I don't really have it today which makes me really, really happy. And I couldn't really see it with my makeup either. So I'm very happy about that. Um, if you're curious as to what my skin care routine or something like that, I'll do like a video on that but I'm just gonna say good night for now I'll try to vlog tomorrow I mean it, it is Friday night um by Friday the vlogs are all, always extremely long but I didn't vlog yesterday or Monday so I think I'm gonna vlog um Saturday and Sunday but yeah I'm just gonna leave it here I had a very busy day I'm very exhausted but I got a lot of things done which makes me really happy and now I can just meditate and fall asleep and wake up super super early and hopefully I can get the video up in time if I finish. Um, I'm gonna try to see how much footage I have to edit so I calculate how many hours I need but yeah you don't need to know any of this I'm just saying like editing stuff um but yeah um good night guys